All right, well, um, welcome back. It appears in my infinite wisdom, I deleted the second episode of this, which, well, um, yep, ah, uh, that sucks. Luckily with this game, not much happened in the, like in between episodes. Really all that happened was I think we added a hunting cabin. We got maybe four more people. And we placed down an herbalist and the quarry was completed. That's pretty much it. I think also we added a tailor and a blacksmith. And then an orchard here. Pear orchard. But other than that, not much happened. So I So I'm really sorry about that. Um hopefully I don't do that again. But, um, yeah, I guess we could just get right into it. We did, we did really just get four more people, which is nice, because we can, what is it, it's early spring. Crap, it is early spring, so we need to start working these farms again. Uh, we need to, where is everyone working? Are they builders? Let's check. Uh, so no, it's this one. Oh. Let's take a fisherman out, add it to a farmer. We need eight farmers. That's a lot of farmers. Oh, duh. Most of them are stone cutters. And we'll take two builders. There we go. There's our eight farmers. Um, Alright, there we go. We did add stone roads, just uh, just just on this path here, just so that way they can get from. Where's the pathing tool? They can get to these farms quicker. Although it seems like nobody's taking, nobody's taking the stone roads yet, except the fishermen. Maybe we could add a path. Oh, they're not even taking the. Nice. You're welcome for putting a path in that you guys aren't even taking. I guess we could just add the path right here. Maybe they just don't like this path right here. Although these two, these people do. Thank you, Byron and Madeline. Oh yes, Madeline, I remember you from the first episode. Maybe it was the second one. Alright, let's speed past this rain. I don't, I don't like the rain. They should start planting here soon. Uh, I think they're just tilling the fields right now. Ah, yes, we have some tiny little trees right here. Those should grow. I don't actually know how long it takes to grow the trees. Possibly more than the one year. But with these four farms... Yeah, see, they're already starting to grow the fishing dock and the hunting cabin. I think we should be well like on our way for food production for a long while. Actually we just got another adult in so I just put him as a stone worker because we are currently low on stone. I think right now we, maybe we want to start thinking about adding uh, adding some of these buildings. Maybe we should put a well in, just in case there's a fire. Schoolhouse... Eh, we really don't need a schoolhouse just yet, because... Still trying to... working on the whole not dying thing. Eh, maybe we could add a tavern. Add a mine, too. If we were to add a mine, we would add it possibly... Must does it need to be placed down a mountainside? I do believe it does. Oh, yeah, I guess it does need to be placed on a mountainside. Which makes sense. So I guess we could add a mine. Hmm. Wait, what's it? Oh, hey, our herbalist got built. So let's remove a hunter and add him as a herbalist.
stone production. Oh, they moved the stone out from under here. They, uh, which is good, but that means we still still don't have much stone. We're a little low on tools. Let's uh let's work this. We have enough firewood, so let's stop this. Add you as a firewood person. Or blacksmith. I'd say we just speed this up until we get more people. So it is currently year four. Uh, late spring. Uh, these wheat fields are... Wheat and corn fields are pretty much all planted. Let's... Boarding house. Ooh. I guess I could have just built a boarding house instead of all these individual houses. I think it's a more expensive, though. Oh. No, we don't need a map. We can just... Oh wait, ooh, 22, so we have an extra, extra, crap, let me just slow down a little bit. We have an extra, 23 adults, so currently we only have one child, which is good, means, let's add another woodcutter, four stone people, two woodcutters. But that means most of our working pop or most of our population is of working age. I wonder where this child is. Uh, should be up oh, here. We are. Ah, right here. She's playing Lorraine. Lorraine. She's age five, so it will be another five years before. She grows into, into an adult, but that's fine. We're growing our stone population very slowly. I wish we could grow it a little faster. I think it's just so far away from the stockpile that it's difficult to, or it just takes a long time to for them to place it there. Let's see, are people taking these roads now? Yes, they're taking that road. Uh, what? <laughs> they're going, they're... These people are the most stubborn people ever. They're literally walking right around the road, just so they don't have to use it. Uh. Wow. <laughs> well, that's fantastic. They won't even use the road. Oh, brilliant. They did the same exact thing right here. These people are going out of their way to not use the roads that I'm building for them. It's fantastic. I think I might actually add a stockpile right here. Just so we... Well, actually... Yeah, just so we... Spend more time cutting than we do carrying. Now that's the herbalist. Do we have seven medicines? That's good. You're a stone cutter. Now our food is going down a little bit. We started at 800. But I think once only once we harvest. Now these trees are currently yeah, I think it might take a couple years for those trees to grow in. So, good thing we planted them now. I think we should be good with just these three farms and the fishing and the hunting for the next year or two until those trees grow in. So let's go into 10 time, ooh, ten speed time, so that way maybe we can get another person. Oop, yep. <laughs> right as I say that. Where is it? It is Wardo. He is of age zero, and he's already already four feet tall. Love it. We will leave Wardo to his playing. So we have two builders. Currently, believe they're idle. 
picking up resources. I think they're uh, builds, yeah. Clearing areas, moving. We might want to think about just leaving one laborer just to move stuff around. Oopsies. Gathers roots. Hmm, I think I think this is good. We'll just speed up time. While we wait. Wow, we have 1,700 food. Most of it is wheat. Uh, I would say that, that is... That is... Perfect. We might even hit 2,000 food with this uh, little bit that they're bringing in right here. Yep, we did hit 2,000 food. That is more than enough for winter. I think I can decrease the number of farmers now. Probably to... Four is fine. Although we can probably stop work here. Yeah, so we. Uh... Yeah, this is good. This is perfect. I wonder if. Well, those trees just got chopped down. 218 wood. I am disappointed that we're not getting as many people as I thought we would get. Maybe they just don't like the tunnel right here. Maybe they just don't like our town yet. We don't really need resource limits so far. So I say we just speed it up. Nineteen hundred food, seventeen hundred food now. We're getting a good, fair amount of medicine, which is perfect. Our tools are also going up. Forty-two tools. It's also keeping our iron limits in check, so we don't have too much iron. Oh, firewood. We should probably have a fire, fire chopper. And now that we have an extra fire chopper, we should probably get an extra wood cutter. What is this a radius? Right around here. Yeah, that's fine. There are enough trees in that area that so we don't need to worry. All right, so those trees are doing fine. We have 20 pear trees. I'm wondering if either next year or the year after they'll grow in. Let's uh let's see where everyone's walking and maybe create a road for them. So let's we could make a road right here. Although they really want this diagonal road. These people love diagonal roads. Once we fill all this area out, though, they won't... They won't... They won't take this diagonal path. It appears as if they also, like, want a tunnel right here. Now they are taking this road again, which is good. A hey, and they finally, they finally are using the roads. Now that I blocked this part off, speed this up. I'd say most of this game is just speeding things up. Maybe we could think about building stone houses, because. They say they're warmer than wooden houses. Although they are fairly expensive, we don't really need houses yet. Get a marketplace. If we're gonna do a marketplace, we might as well do it up here. But we'll save that for later, because I'm thinking we're gonna have houses 
up in this area. We're gonna have our farming stuff over here, industrial area over here. This, yeah, and then fishing docks all along the shore. Still only 25 people. Which is better than the, I think it's 18 that you start out with. I don't know, Ooh, crap, it's early spring again. Let's increase the number of farmers. Uh, let's play. We just bring that down to five times. We've reached the limit on fuel, so we'll move you to be a farmer. We've also reached the limit on tools. Which is good now. This is the dawn of year five. Soon we will have a city. <laughs> Soon as in, maybe. 200 more years. Let's just navigate the menus, see what they have. So they have a, a log of events. Last event was Wardo being born. Which is disappointing. Summer of last year. You'd think more people would be having children. Okay. Save camera locations. Oh well. Ooh, these trees are growing in very nicely. It's probably not going to be this year. Next year. We have only three medicine. Uh, people must be using the medicine to improve their health. Which I guess is good. One of the children grew into an adult. I think that would be Lorraine. If I'm right. Lorraine. Now she is a laborer. Where, where can we assign her? We we need more food. Ladder is a fisher. Fisherwoman. We are getting dangerously low on food. I don't think our hunters are pulling their weight. Considering we only have 22 leather and no meat. Where are they? He's. he's says he's working. Just walking along the shore though. Where's the other one? Just walking around this way. I see no animals. Oops. I don't think there are any. I think we might have hunted all the deer in this immediate area. Now they're... where are they? Let's slow down time so it's not as laggy. I'm not sure where all the deer went. That's okay. Let's tailor. I think we can probably down the tailor, uh, or down the blacksmith up the tailor. We'll pause work. Citizens without jobs, what are you? Tailor? Oh, forgot to hit work. Because we have no clothes. We're gonna need to store the clothes. Or have. Ah! Need to make more clothes <laughs> for winter time. Wait, why, why are these only at 36% while the corn is at 78? That's confusing. On the bright side, we have 78 stone now. A lot of firewood. So I think. Where are the houses? Let's add another house. We'll, we'll make it a wooden house. Just put that right there. So we could probably maybe add a building here in the future. Actually, you know what? Let's do it. Let's add a building here. Here and here. So we'll take the road, bring it right there, and we'll bring the road out like this, and then like that. So we'll put some more houses in this area. Fairly positive, no one's going to move into these houses for a while, but maybe just building the houses will attract more people. We can 
Also, maybe do a wooden bridge. Right here. Just so we can get across the river. Though it's not entirely necessary at this point. But we could add a tunnel. Guess we cannot add a tunnel there. Oop, we can add a tunnel here, though. 76 stone. That is very expensive. Oop, what does this say? Firewood is low. Oop. Let's get rid of that tunnel thing. Cramp. Let's uh remove some of the farmers and add one for the firewood. And then maybe another for wood cutter. I didn't see the harvest, but we only have 1,300 food, which is a little concerning, but with our fisher, fisher people constantly working, it should be fine. Maybe we need a, maybe we might want to, ooh, ooh, 92 venison. Looks like those, uh, are we out of resources? All right, let's you down then our hunters are doing a good job Ooh, people are moving into the houses I guess they don't like it's all squeezing into one house and this should be that's cool though so it should be about two people per house then except for Ooh, we have a 41 year old 44 year old. Eek! Those people are gonna die soon. We need. Definitely want them to be creating children. Because if they start dying of old age, that's not good. We need them to not die. What else could we build? We could build. Town hall. We could build a town hall here, but I think that's a little premature considering we're just a tiny little settlement. Ooh, two people had children. All right, houses are the way to go. More houses it is, then. That's how you do it. Springtime again. Let's just increase the number of blacksmiths. No, not blacksmiths, farmers. Uh, down one for the woodcutter, one for the blacksmith, or er, farmers. We only have one builder. This guy is working hard. Thank you, Boniel. Now let's... Hmm. I'm trying to think about expansion. We'll expand this way with the roads. Let's, you know, let's build a stone house. Actually, that's still really expensive, whereas the wooden houses are super cheap. We'll do... Yeah, just add some houses right there, and what is it saying? Firewood is low. Yes, I know. We have someone working on that. Uh, let's slow down time a little bit. Not that much. Maybe we could add a little farm right, right? Where are you? Apples. F crop field. Add a little farm right here. It's only wheat or corn. Let's do corn. There we go. Just a little variety. Also get us a tiny bit more food. Wow! Houses are the way to go, because we just got... Alright, that is definitely the way to do it. 